All right, guys. Though I haven't posted anything in a couple days, and really good reason. Uh, as you can tell by the fact that I'm swimming in a pool right now, I'm no longer in Ohio. I kind of had to drop everything in my life and come to uh, Houston. Uh, this is where my dad gets his cancer treatment and it's confirmed his cancer is back. Uh, so I'm going to be down here for the foreseeable future doing this. Uh, so that means I am going to have limited funds on things. Uh, I did bring some cards and stuff with me. I got a booster box. I have a Korean booster box. And I have an Aether Revolt pack. So I do have like 70 some card packs I can open. I'm going to spread it out. Uh, probably do vlogs every couple of days. Uh, there's a shit ton of stuff to do down here in Houston. I'm in the medical district, but I brought my skateboard and stuff with me, so I'm just gonna run around this place and find a bunch of different things to do. Uh, drove 19 hours straight last night. I'm on like three hours of sleep right now, so I'm a little bit haggardy. I've just been hanging out in this pool for like the last 45 minutes, having a good time. But yeah, uh, I think I'm gonna go to a park once it gets dark tonight, maybe get robbed and killed or something like that. Uh, but we'll probably do an opening there tonight. I'm not 100% sure yet. Uh, yeah, I'm just real scatterbrained right now. I've got a bunch of different shit going on. Don't really know what's going on with my job or anything. I still got to call FMLA to find out how long of a leave I can take because odds are I'm going to be here for at least three months and that's best case scenario. So if anybody watches this and you happen to be in Houston and want to hang out and play Pokemon or Magic or anything like that, feel free to uh, hit me up in the comments down below. But yeah, I'm going to get back to swimming. Do the uh, room tour quick, real quick here where I'm staying. This is my lovely huge kitchen. We bought a shit ton of ramen and tuna because we eating cheap for right now. That's a refrigerator. Has some water and milk in there. Living area. High class flat screen TV. My bed. Father's bed. Two grown men sharing one room closet, bathroom sink, and the huge luxurious bathroom. This is home for uh, probably about another week here, it's my guess, until we can get into something longer term. But uh, i got about 20-30 minutes before I gotta go pick my dad up from his MRI, so we'll put up some Pokemon packs real quick. Just gonna do this all as one long shot because production values. Okay, I was there. Another cinnamon booster box that happened to arrive in the mail before we got down here. Hopefully, we can finish off the collection with this pack or this box. Kind of doubt it though, the way luck seems to be going here the last couple days. Everything's been going good. We already went to a couple doctors this morning. One, two. I'm gonna try to mix it up around one, two. One, two. Let's see if we can avoid that weird luck we had last time there. But he's getting an MRI right now. I'm uh, just waiting for that to get done. Go pick him up. The good news is we're three, probably like three tenths of a mile from the actual facility where all of his treatment's taking place. So unless that changes, we've got really good luck with that. We're hoping he's got like five appointments tomorrow. We're hoping at least at some point here somebody gets us an idea of a biopsy on Friday. After that, we will know for sure. He meets with his actual main doctor on uh, next Tuesday because he's out of the country right now. Same thing down here. Um, don't be racist and come to MD Anderson. I think most of the patients are white, but the vast majority of people we're, I think all the doctors we've seen so far, we had a white nurse earlier today and then sexy ass fucking, uh, I don't know, I'm gonna guess she was Pakistani. Ooh, nice little Lapras GX, not the full art though. But, it's one to get us started. Yeah, I don't know what ethnic, or well, 
which is something from a Middle Eastern country. God damn, she's a bad little bitch. Like everybody you see down here, like 95% of the women are sexy as fuck. It don't make no sense. There shouldn't be that many good looking women in like the small one mile area. I have to be doing everything in. I'm not complaining about it. It's fucking nice. These don't look too healthy. But yeah, uh, hopefully I can get on a regular schedule so I can start exploring around Houston. Uh, if it wasn't raining right now, I'd go, there's a park with a zoo. I'm gonna ride the train there. Have a good time. Fucking uh, see some real life Pokemon. There's a shit ton of gyms around me. I just haven't had time to take any of them yet. Because most of my days on the computer printing things or calling people right now. Fucking, uh, cancer's a bunch of bullshit. Like, it's not a good time for anybody. Uh, you always say you wouldn't wish things on your worst enemies. And cancer's definitely not something you would wish on anybody. So, this doesn't affect just the person that gets it. It affects everybody. Uh, the person taking care of them. Caregivers, the people, family, like half of my dad's day is just uh, people calling him wanting to know if we have any news yet, if we know anything new. And, and they mean well, but when you're trying to get other shit done and you got 35, 40 people calling you every day, it gets annoying. Luckily, nobody in my family knows my phone number, so they don't call me. It's the one good thing to do a social outcast. Everybody lets you know. I'm just excited, fucking, there's a shit ton of nice stuff around here. Just looking it up, uh, urbexing looks a little bit dangerous, but the fucking old Astrodome is still standing, and I'm like three quarters of a mile from it. I'm really tempted to go into the old Astrodome and break in. Just fucking kind of see what the hell happens. Sorry, this isn't in focus, this is really impromptu, and I'm just going quick. Damn it. Keep showing those upside down because I'm an idiot. Three, four. But yeah. Like I said, once I get everything in a set schedule, I'm not going to do Pokemon every day just because I'm not going to be able to afford that since I'm not working for a while. Like I said, I brought cards with me. Stuff I got in the mail before I left, and I should have a couple things being mailed down here to me that was arriving at my house afterwards. But so, probably only going to be able to put out two to three videos a week for right now, and there may be one ish Pokemon video. If I like find out next week that we're only going to be down here for like a month, I'll go a little bit crazier, but. As of right now, the plan is to stretch things out. I'll probably just do some like exploring around Houston vlog type thing. Mix in a little bit of skateboarding since I brought that with me. And oh my god, so Lapras and Polyrath. The only thing. And the other bad thing about this is I forgot to bring a tin to put Pokemon cards in. So eh, I'll deal with this here in a minute. But I want to show you. My awesome view from the window, too. Got to infinity here. That is... I don't know how well it's coming in over there, but, uh... It's a helipad. Over there. So that's fucking exciting. Good news is I've got headphones on most of the time. So I don't really have to deal with that, but... And I bent the shit out of my cards because they've been in a backpack for a couple days. But, yeah. I'm gonna get out of here. I already edited the first part of this together. Just slap this on there. So uh, I'll talk to you guys here in a couple days. Peace.